so today I'm giving you guys my skincare routine video. Finally, finally. I'm sorry that it's kind of right now. Uh, that's mainly because I'm recording on my phone and I just recorded my whole routine of washing my face and everything, getting it ready for the voiceover, which you guys will hear. So yeah, that's how I roll. I had a different kind of video film before, but I just decided last minute, you know what? I like this way a lot better. I feel like you guys will get to see how I actually wash my face and what I do and how I take care of it. So I feel like it's a lot better. So um, versus me showing you the products and just telling you it's kind of better to show you because I'm a visual learner now like I like I like it visual so I can understand things what's this stop these products that I show you in the video work amazing for me I'm going to have the names on my blog down below so make sure you click that uh, as well as a more detailed um, kind of version of the video of what more that I do. It's not really that much, but I do talk about the Clinique Emergency Mask I have featured before in the past that um, I do use once in a while that is discontinued, but I still do use it because it just it works amazing for my skin. I don't know if it's called something else, like let me know if you know, because I don't think it is, but you know, we'll learn together. It's how we do. By the way, I'm sorry for this hair and this, like, oh, I just have not... Today I've just been home all day, so you know, it's like, eh, I don't feel like it, man. I just want to give you guys a little background with my skin. All of my life, up until about three-ish, three-ish, four-ish years ago, I had perfectly clear skin. I'd have a few pimples here and there, but I never really had, like, the bad acne that a lot of kids had, and I was really grateful for that in middle school and in the beginning of high school. However, um, you guys know, I don't like to talk about this so much, it's not really relevant, but whatever. My ex did break up with me. Who would I, why would anyone break up with this? I mean, come on, not. Mm. <laughs> I disturb you guys in each video, I'm sorry. Ever since our breakup, uh, my face literally the next day broke out horribly, and my face has never been the same since. So. Now I've finally got down a routine that I can manage with my skin and I know it works well for me and it doesn't give me, I still have a few breakouts but they're not as bad as it used to be. It used to be like one here, one here, one here, 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 here. I basically look like a freaking pizza face. Like it was horrible and I hated it and makeup covering and oh my god it was just terrible. There have been other products I've used in the past. I've tried Proactive. I didn't like Proactive. It didn't work on me at all. Acne free system. It worked. It for a little while didn't... Just, I didn't really like the three-step thing, you know, just like, nah, not really. And then, of course, Clean and Clear. I do love Clean and Clear products. I love them, but um, I feel like I like more of the scrubs versus just the cleanser because I like to feel the dirt and the oil coming out of my skin and going down the drain. You know that kind of feeling? Like I just like the feeling of a fresh face, a fresh, clean face. I don't like the feeling like, oh, I'm just washing it. And it's all staying there inside my pores. Like, it's not leaving. Like, I just like the scrubs a lot more, I figured out. So, that's my personal preference. And I love these products so, so much. They're amazing. They've worked great for me and my skin. And I could not ask for anything better. So, stay tuned for my skincare routine. And I will show you guys how I wash my face every night. Yes, every night. I don't wash... I wash my face during the day kind of rarely. Mm, yeah, is that weird? I wash it in the morning if I know I'm going to take a shower in the morning and I'll just wash my face after. But besides that, I don't do it in the morning. I always do it at night. Um, as weird as that is, that's just how I do. So yeah, without further ado, here's my routine. I love you guys. Hope you enjoyed it. And like I said, everything else will be on my blog. Love you guys. Hey guys, so the first thing I'm going to be doing, since as you guys can see, I am not wearing any makeup on my face today at all. I would normally use my e.l.f. makeup wipes, but since I'm not, I'm going to go straight to my cleansers. So I have my Aveeno Smart Essentials Daily Detoxifying Scrub and my Neutrogena Oil-Free Acne Wash. Since I use my Aveeno, I'm going to be using my Acne Wash today. I alternate between days, but before that, the first thing I do is I always wash my hands before I wash my face because you have a lot of germs and oils and you don't want all that nasty on your face. Then I take my cleanser, obviously, and just put like about a dime, maybe more than a dime amount on my hands. I don't know. I just eyeball it. And lather it up and put it all over my face and scrubbing everywhere. I focus on the areas where I'm most acne, so like my cheeks, my chin, my nose, and my forehead are big ones, especially on the sides of my face. 
scrubby. And this looks really wrong, I know. But next I wash my face and dry it with a dry towel or a washcloth. And there's Jess trying to give me a towel, but I clearly have something. I don't know. <laughs> and I try to make sure there's no soap or no nothing left on my face. And the last thing I do is take my generic Care One moisturizing lotion, obviously known normally as Cetaphil. Use about half a pump and just rub that all over my face. Moisturizing is really important because once you wash your face, you can be prone to dry skin and just it's just not it's just not nice. So you know we got we gotta oil that up. Oil? No lotion? What? I'm really weird when I put on my stuff. I'm sorry. And that was my skincare routine. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I love you guys. Bye. And Jess says.